Praise be Jesus Christ. One of the graces St. John Bosco had is he was able to read souls. Now, some people might say, well, this may have happened on the extreme rare occasion and the claims that he could do this were probably based on kind of rumors and we don't exactly know if this really happened. Well, it turns out that St. John Bosco had such a strong gift for being able to read souls and did this so often that they just spoke openly about it and, and, and gave examples. Uh, uh, in this little book here on St. John Bosco, it says, a group of boys gathered around Don Bosco and there was a new boy who joined them. They were speaking of his wonderful power of reading souls and several gave personal instances. So again, this isn't something that it happens extremely rarely and there was just rumors about. No, the boys are hanging out and they just happen to start talking about how St. John Bosco, how Don Bosco can read souls. And the boys start giving examples of, of how he's done this as if, you know, no big deal. And so this, the newcomer who was joining them says, oh, said the newcomer, I defy Don Bosco to read my soul. If he can, he is welcome to publish all my secrets. Come here, said the saint, smiling, and bending down, he began to whisper in the boy's ear. Then stopping, he looked steadily at him for a moment, and then began again. The boy got redder and redder. And there's examples where Don Bosco, he'd give details that there is no way that he, he would be able to get this information. There's no way he could know this. Details of, of time and situations. Uh, and again, it was just a common, or a fairly common reality in the life and ministry of Don Bosco. He could read souls. When you'd go to confession, it wasn't uncommon for him to help the penitent out to remember the sins he couldn't remember, or sometimes even a, 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 a sinner was too embarrassed to mention it. And Don Bosco was always so gentle, so merciful. He'd say, do you want me to help you out? And he would just mention them and the person would just nod in agreement. So just, just a great, wonderful, uh, one, uh, great, wonderful wonder worker uh, of modern time. He died in 1888. So this isn't kind of legends based on the Middle Ages. Uh, there were so many people who could confirm St. John Bosco worked wonderful miracles by the grace of God. Okay, in Mark chapter 16, the last verse, But they went forth and preached everywhere, while the Lord worked with them, and confirmed the word through accompanying signs. Viva Cristore!